Hello, welcome to Dietitian Review, and my name is Dietitian Fechi, and we are still on our nutrient series. And today we'll be talking about vitamin B complex. Okay, um, we are supposed to handle this vitamin okay individually, but because they do related functions in the body, that's why we want to take them as one. Okay. Vitamin B complex, there are about seven of them or eight of them, but we will deal with them as one because they are doing almost the same function. All right. So before we delve into it proper, um, I would like you to go and subscribe to this channel because we are bringing a whole lot. This is a channel where you get evidence-based nutrition information that will help you live a healthy life okay and that's our goal that's why we are doing what we are doing and we want to build your confidence around your food that is what this series is for we want to build your confidence around that food the same way people who take medications they have enough confidence that their drug is enough to make them healthy so you need this confidence you need to know what these nutrients are what they are for Okay, so we delve right in. Okay, now vitamin B complex is a water soluble vitamin which performs a lot of functions in the body. They are vitamin B1, which is thiamine, vitamin B2, which is riboflavin, vitamin B3, which is niacin, vitamin B5, which is pantotenic acid, vitamin B6 is pyridoxin. Vitamin B7 is biotin, and vitamin B9 is folate or folic acid, and then vitamin B12 is scobalamin. Alright, so these are the B complex vitamins which helps the body perform various functions. Some of those functions are cell health. Okay. They help to improve yourself. They help to grow yourself the same way the vitamin A does. Vitamin B also helps, you know, to improve the health of various cells in the body. Okay, even the growth of red blood cells. Red blood cells is one of the things that helps in blood production. So. Vitamin B complex helps the growth of the cell. It helps for hormone and cholesterol production. It also helps in cardiovascular health. It helps in muscles, okay, to build the muscle tones. All right? So these are the functions of vitamin B complex. So each of them have some of these functions and that is it. Now, what are the sources of vitamin B complexes? Okay, vitamin B complex can be found in your milk, your cheese, your liver, your kidney, your meat. Meat such as chicken, you can find your vitamin B complex in it. Fish, fish, all kinds of fish. There is vitamin B complex in them, and then dark green vegetables you can find your vitamin b complex in them such as spinach but vegetables are you know they have they contain a high dose of these nutrients these vitamins okay so spinach pumpkin and then whole grain yes whole grain has a lot of it all right and then legumes such as beans, soy products, and all that. Okay, so these are sources of vitamin B complex. All right. Now we want to talk about the deficiency. What can the deficiency of vitamin B complex cause? So vitamin B complex has some issues when it's deficient in the body. It can lead to anemia, it can lead to digestive problems, it can lead to anemia, nerve problems, digestion issues, 
skin conditions and then infections so some of these are some of the problems that vitamin b complex can lead to now what happens when you have them in excess what happens when your body have vitamin b complex in essence now it's rare for you to have vitamin b complex in essence especially when you're eating it from your food the reason is because vitamin b complex is not stored in the body the body uses as much as it wants per day and then excretes the other all right so if you're taking it as a supplement just like Pregnant women, they are giving some of them to help them, you know, with several functions that increases due to pregnancy. Okay, so for but for normal people, you don't need it unless you have issues with your absorption or digestion or anything. Okay, you don't necessarily need vitamin B complex as a supplement. Okay, it's because it can lead to a few a few issues in the body and some of the issues are vitamin b6 can in excess can lead to neuropathy okay that's a now folate or folic acid can also lead to nervous system problem and then niacin can lead to skin issues and then when you abuse it for a longer period it can lead to damage of your liver all right so these are some of the issues that may arise as a result of taking this vitamin B complex in essence. So this is where we are wrapping up today's episode. And I'd like you to subscribe to this channel because we have more coming your way on this nutrient series. Our goal is to help you build your confidence around your food and to help you live a healthy life with evidence-based nutrition information. So until I come your way next time, keep being nutrition conscious. Bye for now.